So th this is what I thought we'd do today. Um, let me spend just five minutes showing you a little bit about us, okay? So you have a little bit of a better idea of the, of the system. Uh, let's finish it off by going in and looking at one of our customers, okay? And let's go look at their results here. And so you kind of get an idea for how they're interacting with the system as it's running, okay? And then let's finish off with uh, looking at your uh, at the results that I got for you. How does that sound? Sounds good. All right, let's go make that happen. And and um, I'm going to try to get this all done in 15 minutes or so. Does that sound good to you, too? I don't know how you're doing on time. Yeah, that'd be perfect. Okay. Let's just jump into it. Um, yesterday, I, I sent you uh, basically a few links that takes you to our product, a website, okay? Um, the the Dunfew Lead Factory is actually a product that we have built on top of this marketing automation platform that you see right here at leadoutcome.com, okay? And this is a product we've been around for since 2012. Uh, we've got about $5 million invested in this product. And um, we've developed some very interesting ways uh, to, to find leads and, uh, and get them in front of you, high-quality leads. And, and so you're getting the benefit of all that in this done-for-you solution we call the done-for-you lead factory. Make sense so far, right? Yep. Okay. So here uh, on this web page that you're looking at right here at this website, okay, let me just make this a little bit bigger. Um, there we go. Uh, there's a 47 second concise video that explains just how this system works. Um, if you read down through here, you'll learn a little bit about the benefits of the system and some things you can think about when you're evaluating it. Uh, when you go to the How It Works page, uh, there's a five-minute video where Stephanie mm -hmm. will, will just take you on a flyover, kind of give you a little bit of insight into that. And if you wanted to really get a better understanding for the system, just uh, click on the Yes, I Want to See It and Action button. And that will take you to um, to a recorded webinar that uh, I did a little while ago that walks you through it. And we've included these little hyperlinks in here to you know so you can skip over the five minute intros. I'm talking to other people, and you can get straight to the information that you're looking for, right? So uh, help me understand. You know, will it work for me? Uh, help me look under the hood, see it actually, see me working with it, and, and that sort of a thing. Okay? Perfect. All right, that's that. Uh, we've got some articles that th – this is kind of nice, okay? This one especially right here, this uh, Ultimate Sales Productivity Tools, um, you'll like that. There's some really uh, nice free tools uh, that we include with this that um, I use them every day. They're very effective at – Especially, you know, should you start using the system, uh, you know, when we're starting to get you appointments, being able to efficiently work through uh, those those opportunities. I've got five tools here that are really awesome. They're all free. And even if you don't get our system, go look at this. You'll, you'll like it. Uh, we've got an FAQ section. Helps you uh, get answers common questions that people have asked asked in the past. And on reviews, the one thing I would do is I would look at Denise's uh, 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 review of our system. She is a commercial real estate loan broker. She's the one we're going to go look at today uh, to see her results. Uh, but here, you, you kind of hear her talk about how she's uh, actively using the system, and, and it'll probably help you a little bit. Okay. All right. So that's it. Um, you know, should you decide to get started with us, you know, I'll walk you through that and we'll skip all that, all right? Uh, leadoutcome.com, that's the website if you want to 
learn a little bit more about us as staff, right? Okay, so now let's switch over to uh, the, the system itself. And, and let me just walk you through this one thing right here, which is what is in the system, right? What is included? So first of all, this is a 100% done for you managed lead services. We handle all aspects of the lead generation. The only thing that you're going to be doing is you're going to be receiving these leads in your inbox as this image is showing you right here, right? And uh, so with the system, you get a dedicated uh, lead factory account manager who's going to help you build your ideal customer profile, which is we've already kind of done a little bit of that already, right? But we use that information to build what we call your lead seed packet, which is really is very focused on identifying the people that we think are a good match for you. We're going to get you in front of 50 of them per day. It's roughly 1,000 a month. That's 12,000 a year. And we've already talked through all that, all right? Okay. Uh, we have some uh, nice reporting tools that every day you can see what BJ's team is doing with your account. You can see your connections going up, your leads going up, who's opening. Uh, then you'll see the quarterly follow-up for live campaign, how it's bringing all of our leads back in front of you, and you can see all that happening. Okay, so that's that. That's the system. Any questions so far? No. Okay. All right, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you this thing right here. And this is Denise Benelli the loan officer, and what we're going to do is what, what happens when you use our system is we, we're going to create for you what we call our virtual sales assistant. But think of it like a very smart inbox that's got some uh, AI stuff on the back end, but it's, it, it does a lot of stuff. And um, it sits in between you, your inbox, and the prospect that's, that's coming uh, in through LinkedIn today on our base system, okay? And so what happens is uh, that prospect, he connects with you, and then what a uh, BJ team will once a week go in and pull all those people out and bring them into the system. The system will then go through a 14-day warm-up campaign where it's going to be targeting them. And as those messages are coming into this intermediate inbox, we're going to be evaluating them and forwarding them on to you, uh, the, the good ones, and making sure we keep all the noise out. And, uh, and so that, and that's what you're going to see here in just one second. That makes sense? Yeah. Okay. All right. So let's go look at Denise. I am logged into Denise's. Uh, inbox. This is a, a, happens to be a, a, a Gmail account. And what you're looking at here is um, get this screen. Out. What you're looking at here, if you look at the far right column, you see this over here? And, and Denise has been using our system now, uh, you know, over a year and a half. And so her system is really optimized. The more you use the system, the stronger it gets, right? Our talk about that quarterly campaign keeps bringing you back around. And so, plus, we've got AI technology that's really helping you with penetrating into people's inboxes and getting them to respond. And uh, so, so, anyway, so here you can see August 14th. You can see she's had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven people responding to her. If you look here on the left, Faze, Ginger, Fabio, Kristen, uh, Sharon, these are all different people. Now, every single one of these people, um, uh, Denise does not know them. She's never met them before. Uh, our guys have gone in. They're going in every day doing those 50 invitations, pulling them out bringing in the system, uh, the, the, the virtual sales assistant is going in, warming them up until they're ready. Now they start to come, uh, and, and this is what she's receiving in her inbox. So now let's go, let's go back a little bit further. Uh, 14th, 13th was a Monday, August 9th, going back to Friday. And you can see just going back in time, the 7th, the 6th. Once again, look over here on the left-hand side, you'll see that um, 
uh, that the names keep changing, right? Uh, August, July 30th, 29th, 28th, 27th, 26th, 25th. Okay, let's go back, 22nd, 19th, 18th, 17th. And these are all people that are coming out of that, that profile, that, that ideal customer profile that you and I are working on, okay? Make sense? Yep. Okay, you'll notice the messaging slightly changing up. So you, you'll see a pattern, nice connecting with you. And then, uh, you know, so, so there's about eight messages in total that are running. Uh, all at, at different times. So, all right, so let's just take a look and um, see what we call measuring success and how you plug into the system. So um, Denise is getting this, is, we're doing this for her. Uh, hey, Blaze, I know you're busy. In case you did not get my last message, this is already three messages. This is about 10 days into this campaign. And Blaze has not responded on the first message, not the second message. And now we're going into the third message, and it's Blaze. I know you're busy. In case you didn't get my last message, I wanted to see when is a good time for us to uh, have a quick call for us to explore opportunities that could benefit us both. Okay, and so we put appropriate call to actions in there. We, with our system, you get a a, a calendaring system where people can auto schedule themselves directly into your calendar, and. How wonderful is that? You walk in the uh, in the office and and you've got somebody already set up and queued for you to have a call. All you need to do is go look and see, uh, learn about them a little bit before you before you start talking to them, right? So this was the message that came out came uh, into Blaze. How did Blaze respond to this? Let's get to see. Blaze responds with, "Hey Denise, may I call you in 15 minutes?" Of course you can, right? And so one of the things we do recommend for you is once you get your uh, calendar account set up, and we do this for you, is you just tell us, um, you know, what time do you want to, to do sales calls? And we'll, we'll set that up in the calendar and so that people can book themselves. But here it is, uh, the lady saying, hey, Denise, may I call you in 15 minutes, right? That's, that's, uh, that's called measuring success. Some people, they'll just pick up the phone and call you. That's called measuring success. Uh, Ginger says, hey, uh, I like how you uh, reach out to those that connect with you on LinkedIn. Uh, we, we already know each other, remember me, so this happens to be somebody that, uh, that Denise knew through some other uh, means. Uh, Fabio, um, uh, so, uh, hey, we have to stop meeting like this. Ha, ha, cheers. Uh, give me a call. And Kristen, how does tomorrow look like for you, Chris? Okay. Now, and the thing to know, Mark, is I'm showing you these, and they happen to be all good. Not all of them are going to be people saying, hey, I want to meet with you. you. You will get some where people are saying, hey, I'm not interested, or they're going to say, I'm too busy right now. Um, uh, okay, here's a good example, Larry, right here. Uh, Hi, Denise. I'm really not in the market for financing right now. I'll be in touch when there is the potential. Okay. Now, this guy, Larry Nadel, that's not a bad lead. It's just the timing's wrong for him. And the quarterly follow-up for life is going to automatically keep bringing Denise in front of him. So in three months, the system's going to go out on her behalf and say, hey, Larry, here I am. Uh, uh, do you have a potential buyer now? You know, are you ready now? Are you not so busy, right? And so, okay. Does that make sense? Uh, how does it know to do, put it on a quarterly? Uh, system automates that. We completely take care of that, okay? And I'm, another question you might have is, well, how does it know when somebody's responding to not send any other messages, right? Right. And, and that's part of the uh, technology we have under the hood that automate, that's part of why this interim in, inbox is really critical uh, because we're listening to this thing all the time. We're watching it. We're uh, doing everything with it. And when we see that somebody is responding to you, we'll automatically pull them off that campaign. Okay? The quarterly, as soon as they go in, we're putting them on the quarterly and it's rolling. If at if, if, if any point somebody doesn't like you, uh, then, you know, we'll uh, unsubscribe them completely from the system for you. Okay? okay. Make sense? Yep. All right. So, so, uh, Mark, that's the system. It, that's it. it. It's pretty much that simple. 
Okay. So basically, so, a message shows up in their email box. In in your inbox. I mean, in in theirs. I mean, they're responding to an email. That's right. They're responding. So what happens is, we start off with an invitation to them, and they're going to look at your profile. And when they look at your profile, they're going to make a decision. Mark has something for me or not. If they do not do that, we will never, ever contact them. So we will never, ever spam somebody. If they don't want to talk to you, we're not going to be those people that are getting in your face uh, that, and you don't want to be uh, spoken to, right? So they're going to make that, that, that – they're going to accept that invitation. Once they do that, that's going to unlock their email address. And then what will happen is uh, BJ's team is coming in once a week. Uh, every day they're doing your invitations for other people. But once a week they come in, anybody that's, uh, that's accepted, they get pulled into the system. And then we do these campaigns. Those campaigns are now doing what you just said. They're sending four messages over a two-week period. Those messages are very carefully orchestrated. There's a lot of psychology that's gone into them. They're very effective, okay? And they yield these kind of results, not by chance. We've done a lot of a lot of split testing to get to this point, okay? One of the benefits you get for uh, uh, being in this program, okay? And so, yes, they're, we're sending out these messages, and we're trying to get them to reach back out to you. The people that are interested, they're going to do exactly what you just saw here. And, and then at that point, that's when you're plugging in and you're going to take it from there. And we'll give you some tips on, on how to approach these people. And uh, they're already coming out of your ideal customer profile. They're already people you've spoken to in the past, uh, very similar. So you'll, you'll know what to do with them. And, um, and then at that point, you know, marketing has done its job and now sales takes over. And for you, uh, you've, you've got somebody that's reaching out to you. It's not a cold call. They know you, and they've made the decision to reach out to you to say, I'm calling you in 15 minutes, right? You see what I'm saying? Yep. Okay. You good? I am. All right. Any other questions? No, nope. just uh, I'm, my mind's spinning a little bit on the right – I guess profile and and uh, yeah. to the contact. Yeah, let's let's go deal with that next. Okay, so uh, I'm going to go to that email I just sent you and and let's see if we can work on that. So I did a, an initial search and we talked about you know one of the things you do is you do a lot of refinancing uh, and it, it's usually like people going in and and they're going to refinance their home, get a large chunk of money out. They're doing some kind of upgrade. And um, the other thing we, we talked about is they may want to do some kind of, you know, uh, real estate investing. And so we said, okay, let's let's go. You know, I told you I'm not going to be able to find you people that want to refinance. That, or if I did, that I can go after those engineers like we talked about, but I just don't think it's going to be as fruitful as, as we'd like. So we said, okay, well, if we go after the engineer, the, the guy who is wanting to refinance to go buy a property, who would that be, right? And, and we're going to go look at these guys in just a second. We said the real estate investor. So the engineer, he's got extra money. He wants to go and uh, put it in and buy a, 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 become a property manager, become a, a landlord, you know, get into the real estate business. Don't put all of his money in the stock market. Nowadays, you create an LLC, and uh, you can pull money out of your your uh, your your funds that you've got. Or maybe you don't want to do that. You want to leverage the money that's in your uh, in, in your company. Or either way, they're going to need they're not, they're going to need the 80% funded, right? Uh, they're they're going to pull the money out to cover their uh, their P&I and I and get that down. So, you know, every real estate investor, no matter what, is going to need funds, and that's what you do. And, and so we've got – I'm going to show you that in a moment, but I found 4,100, okay? That's a healthy number. Remember I told you 
in order for this for you to qualify for me, I've got to see big numbers like that. And so that's a good sign, and that's all in California. Um, then the other group we talked about was financial advisors. Uh, we feel like financial advisors are people that know other people who've got a lot of money um, and a way for them to not lose uh, people putting that money somewhere else that can just put a little bit down, use you as a funding source, uh, financial advisors. That was a good lead seat packet, right? And then the third one we discussed was mortgage broker slash agent. Um, you know, that one's pretty obvious. Every single one of those people is a distribution deal of potentially, you know, five to ten sales. Uh, what I did for you there is uh, I found brokers and agents who are more likely to be focused on third-party funding sources. And so I got rid of Callwater, Remax, Keller Williams, and we came up with 27400 Okay? Make sense? Yeah, because they have their own in-house. Yeah, yeah. We, 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 there's no. It's just a waste of time for us to connect you with, with, with those other ones, right? Okay. So let's go take a look at these guys. All right. So as part of your system, what we will be doing is we're going to be optimizing your profile. So I'm going to give you some tips and strategies on how we can target it for whichever campaign we're going to initially start off with, okay? Um, and, then, uh, and then we'll use Sales Navigator to really get very focused on, on these people. So let's take a look first at the real estate investors. Uh, these are people we're thinking that are individuals, have extra money, want to invest in real estate, and uh, they're based out of California, and let's take a look at it, okay? So here you can see, if you look at my results, I'm filtering by California, and um, I've got real estate investors selected, and let's, let's just take a look at some of these guys. What I like to do here is look at the people's faces and make sure that jives with who I've seen as my customer, right? I look at their their who they work for, uh, what their titles are, and it kind of gives me a little bit of a sense for, you know, I've got forty, uh, I've got four thousand one hundred people here. Is is this a good lead seed packet, right? So this guy John Ferguson, he's self-employed, uh, you know, he's slightly older, he's probably got some money, okay. If I'm seeing a bunch of you know young people, then then I need to maybe adjust my uh, my filter. Hey, you don't always have a picture, but, um, you know, uh, you, you just can kind of look through this. Uh, William Bazard, real estate investor, uh, you know, he's got a very uh, a professional look about him. Yeah, not bad. Isaac, uh, construction corporation. We may want to filter this guy out. I don't know, you know. Uh, construction corporation, maybe. We'll, we'll, we'll think about that. Hugo, real estate investor. Um, let's see, we've got Car Carissa, the PowerSide Solutions. Uh, you know, look at Charles McKinney, right? Uh, he, he he looks like that guy that may be wanting to, you know, do a little bit on the side, right? Uh, Michael Cacon, uh Brody Jackson, you know, uh, Brett Hine. I don't know. What do you think? Are these people you could see as your your potential customer? Yeah. Yeah, I can. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's, uh, I like to Those go to page two. They're self-described real estate investors. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Exactly. Um, okay, you know, I like to go to page two and because, uh, uh, you know, sometimes page one is, is – it's just not okay. Yeah, yeah, I like what I'm seeing so far. Okay. All right, so that's this lead seed packet. Any questions? So each one of these would receive um, in a, I guess in a year's time, they would receive at least one email. 
No, no, no. Uh, we're going to start connect as soon as you join with us. Okay, fifty people of out of this forty one hundred are getting a message from you every single day. It's the equivalent of you going to the Chamber of Commerce and having an event for real estate investors and these 50 people showing up, except for we're automating for you and we're doing it every single day. And we're not just doing that, we're also gonna do the survey at the end that says, who's interested in talking to me? And whoever is, please sign up here and I'm gonna schedule a, a, a meeting with you and Mark. Okay, all right, that right. we're doing. I mean, it all, all start. no, it's, I know that's not all that's done. I was just trying to think of like, if if we just did investors, let's say, Mm -hmm. Then if there's 50 a day, then in 82 days, they would have been hit at least once. They're going to be hit. Each one of these people, uh, is, they're going to be hit once. And the ones that accept and say you have something, they're going to be hit an additional four times. Right. Okay. Days. Okay. And then the ones that don't respond. Mm -hmm. We don't care about it. They're not interested. Move on. Okay. We're going at a rate of 50 a day, 50 a day, 50 a day. Okay, and usually what we see is about a 20 to 30 percent conversion rate is is what we're seeing. That's that's what I would expect if I was you. Yeah, that's 820 responses. Mm -hmm. Yeah, probably about yeah, in the day. I just showed you Denise, right? She, she was doing, right now she's doing seven a day, and they're not always seven a day, okay? And I don't want right. you to be thinking that, okay? And there, sometimes you'll go a couple of days, you won't have anything, and then you'll have 10 on a day, and then you'll have five on a day. And 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 by the way, also, I, I told you, you don't have to log into a, a system, but some people want to, and this system is there. And once you join with us, um, you can log into the system and you can do things like Denise will do a monthly newsletter on top of that. And she will do uh, a quarterly uh, webinar. And so these people are here for you to market and you've got a full blown marketing automation system that's completely loaded, ready to go that you can take advantage of if you want. Okay. And that's when that's, we start going. Is that of the total number, like the full 4,100? Uh, th that is of the people that say they want to talk to you, that have accepted. Okay. Okay. okay gotcha. Okay. So, uh, so you you can think over a year. Uh, I mean, you you can look right here with 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 Denise, right? I'm logged into her account. Uh, she's got um, she's got roughly ten thousand leads that we generated for her. Uh, you can see this month we're what you know around the sixteenth. We've generated 300 leads for her this month. Okay, um, and the system is just running and it's doing what it's what I told you. You know, she's got another uh, um, another couple of weeks. Now, I'm not saying you're going to have that success on the way out the door. She's been with the system for 18 months, and it is it is you know it's compounding, right? And so now you're going to have very good success with it. And remember, you, you remember what we said. We need two deals for you to break even on this thing. And she's got 293 people in two weeks. You, you understand? It makes sense, right? But what I wanted to show you was some other yeah, things. I'm just, yeah. At, yeah, I know what you're saying about breaking even, but the mm -hmm. reality is, is that on my type of deal, I don't have over a, maybe a 20% expense, you know, funded, closed funded ratio as far as Cost. Mm -hmm. I need to do. I need to do five of these to have it. You know, five to one. Yeah, it, I, I told you, Michael Klein did one hundred and fifty thousand dollars with us in in, in 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 four months. Okay, it's it's. Anyways, you you, you got to figure that out for yourself. I, I'm just showing you the got the it. system a little bit, right? Uh, the other got thing it. I want to show you in here is just the open rates. So. The open rates are at 50%, 45%, 50%. These are people she's never, ever met before. Those numbers are unheard of for a cold list, okay? And that's part of what we're doing that is hard to reproduce. 
Okay. Okay. So let's get back to your lead seed packet. So we, we, we've talked about um, we, we've talked about the investors. Let's go look at the financial advisors next. Right? And, and we can split this up too. So we can go one month we'll do uh, 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 real estate investment. Next month we'll do financial advisors. Third month we'll do mortgage brokers. Uh, I mean, uh, uh, real estate brokers or agents, right? And and we'll, we'll just mix it up. All right, let me do this. So just on financial advisors alone, we're at fourteen point nine thousand. Okay. Now, I think with this number we can get more targeted than that. And we probably just need to think through that a little bit, right? To think through maybe financial advisors who maybe have this type of a person, right? And so, you know, I think we just need to spend a little bit of time thinking about it. But the point here, even at that, we've got 14,000 people in California that are potential referral sources that's a that's a very healthy number from my perspective okay and if you look right here and you look once again let's look at the people let's look at their titles okay maybe what we're, we try to do is try to think about which financial advisors you're going to have the most success in penetrating with so is it the guy who has a lot of business is it a financial advisor who's targeting tech companies is it a financial advisor who's targeting the engineers who who would be a good fit we you know so we have to think through that and we can we can get very specific with that we can go 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 target them much more than what i'm showing you here right now okay but once again just looking at these faces these are these are pretty good in my opinion what do you think yep i think they would all be potential yeah okay all right, so let's take a look now at, okay, yeah. And this was the third group, okay? So what we've done is we've gotten rid of uh, the big ones. And you, 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 if you find others, you just need to tell me who they are. Um, but Josh Altman, uh, that, you know, real estate agent, real estate agent. Here's brokers. Maybe we just focus on brokers, right? Um, you know, and as you get going, you, you, you'll figure that out. You know, you'll start having good calls and, and you'll say, well, get me more of these people. Let's look at him. You know, we get a few deals closed. We'll really look at, at and, and look at these people to see what their behaviors are, uh, you know, that sort of a thing and, and see how we can get more focused on, on specifically repeating that for you. All right. <clears throat> yeah, I think uh, yeah, that's great. Yeah, because there's so many of them. Maybe agents. We can you know try to do agents in the Southern California area. True. Yeah. 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 Uh, where are you based out of? San Clemente, which is uh, South Orange County. Orange County. Let's let's go try that. Let's see see what comes up. Okay, so we do the greater Los Angeles area, which I think is Orange County, isn't it? Well, when you ask Orange County, we're not, but a lot of people throw Orange County and greater Los Angeles. Okay. So you probably won't see, on LinkedIn, you probably won't see them categorizing themselves in. Um, uh, yeah, so I can do zip codes too. Okay, so I can come in here and and uh, so you can give me the zip codes and then I can do ranges too, like 10 miles, 15 miles, 20 miles, and uh, so we can get closer if you want to. Okay. Uh, you know what? Let's do let's do that. Let's do um, 40. Let's say 30 miles okay. from 92672. Nine two six seven two, right? Yeah. 
Yeah, I see it. Uh -huh. Probably for 50 miles is good. All right, so I got 9,000. Yeah, so you're hitting you're hitting Orange County and San Diego County and South LA yeah. probably. Yeah. So there'd be plenty in that area. Yeah. Yeah. My my initial thought would be that. The agents kind of, they seem to, you know, in our business, a lot of the uh, <clears throat> individuals are independent. So they mm -hmm. kind of send, send their deal where they want it to go. You know, they work with the people they want to work with. Sometimes okay. the broker controls it, but um, kind of not the norm, I guess. Okay. They can kind of work with whoever they want. So um, the real Maybe. estate agent might be in. Uh, might be better. Yeah, because the broker, a lot of brokers do represent uh, a lot of, but a lot of them, if they're managing an office, they might not be that involved in origination. But okay. um, like you said, we can find out. Mm -hmm. And with that, in your zip code, we got 6,000 we can work with. You within the uh, the 50 miles? Yeah. Yeah. So that's a good number right there. I, I like this lead C packet right here because we tilted out the big boys. Should I say that? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. And you yeah. think 6,000 is a good number? Yeah, yeah, that's plenty. So, so what does that mean, right? For for my guys, that that'll last us roughly six months, just on that alone. Okay. So, uh, I, I, you know, I know I've got to, I I can get you in front of a lot of people there, and uh, so and that's that's one of them, right? And uh, we we can do uh, a lot better than that. Uh, actually, let me do it like this. That's it. Okay, so I've got that, all right? So what happens, Mark, is I'm going to take that and my guys, and let's just go take a look at Denise. And this is what I was describing to you as um, how I make sure my guys are doing the job for you. And this is a report that you can, I'm going to be sharing this with you as well. And so here you can see uh, Denise is really focused on the commercial real estate space, and she's looking for investors that are in, in that. Here I can see my guy's last activity with her was on August 10th. Uh, I can see she had, at the time, 6,975 connections, right? On August 3rd, she had 6,959. So I always know what they're doing. This lead seed packet is what I just say. So I know the guys are getting the connections done. They're getting them done in your zip code. They're going after the right people. Uh, I see in here how many leads. I want to see that number always going up. Uh, I know when they've imported last for you. And, and then right here what I do is I get them to uh, give us the exact uh, I get them to take a picture of invites before and after, so I know that they're getting done properly. And so for you, let's say you're like really busy and uh, you don't have time to deal with me, you can just go into LinkedIn, do a new search, save it, put it into the spreadsheet, and the guys would start using it the very next day. Okay. Now you're probably not going to want to do all that. We always do that. You can just send me a message and and then I'll get that taken care of for you. But I want to point this out to you, that this report really allows us to keep our finger on the pulse and know exactly what's going on. Got it? Yep. 
Alrighty, sir. I am like way over my 15 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> sorry about that. Yes, I'm sorry. I just picked up the phone. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah no worries. A any questions? No, I, I think that I, I kind of see your company as like managing uh, LinkedIn marketing. You know, that's so it was basically what it is for me. This is uh, a, a base, our base system does that. We, we can do a lot more than that, but uh, it's, uh, it's, it's the, the source happens to be LinkedIn. There's a lot of marketing automation that's going in on the back end to get it to work the rest of the way. Oh, outside of LinkedIn. Yeah, yeah. We, the only thing we do on LinkedIn is we, we make invitations and we pull them out. We do everything by hand. And it's very controlled, okay? We, we don't use any software inside of LinkedIn. And the thing we're doing with LinkedIn is we're doing what they want you to do. My guys are essentially your secretary. They're going in, getting that done. And once we pull them out, the marketing automation system is picking up. Yeah, it definitely seems like if uh, – I'd have to think this through a little bit, but I think the gamble uh, on, like you said, $750, <clears throat> and that that $750, is that a recurring each month? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then as soon as – you said that was a discount to what you normally yeah. charge – yeah, how does that just continue to go on as long as I keep it rolling? That's right. That's right. It's uh, so like at the end of this month, it, it'll be fifteen hundred, which is what most people are are, are paying, and um, and it, it, it's just you know, it, it's yeah, it, it, that, it's it's that that's the standard rate, and uh, you know the the way. That's why we look for opportunities with companies that when they make one or two sales, it pays for the system, um, you know, pretty much uh, very easily, right? Right, right. Yeah, so your ROI. Your ROI is 12,000 people. We're getting you in front of them one year. Every single one of them is the potential for some real business, Right. And um, so what is, what is your risk? So what is the chances of you not closing on 12,000 people we're getting in front of, right? And uh, so that risk you know is very low because I've shown you Denise Michael's account, and you know they're month to month as well, and they've been using the system for 18 months. And they also can they can stop at any time. Denise is based out of uh, North Carolina. Yeah, it'd be interesting to see what kind of results you could be able to get here. Mm. Yeah. And then as far as um, because I'm kind of jumping ahead here a little bit, but let's say. I'm going to – I would pay lead outcome? Yeah, that's what you're doing is you're paying us seven fifty a month. And so basically the process is you give us a credit card, and uh, we'll put the recurring payment on it once we've got everything set up for you, and it just charges every month. And uh, if you're not happy with it, you just call us up, and we turn it off, and, and you're good to go. All right, and then you've got some type of a agreement, I guess. Yeah, I'll send you an invoice. Uh, as part of the install, uh, you're, you're going to, you know, agree to allow us to log into your LinkedIn account and make invitations on your behalf. And um, so, so you'll you'll have those two things. Uh, your your lead outcome account is ensuring, you know, everything we do in terms of email is spam compliant. Uh, we're very very, very cautious about that. But you can see with our numbers of 40 to 60%, you 
you, you're just not going to have any issues with that. Yeah, and with my LinkedIn account, I remember setting it up a decade ago, probably. <clears throat> I don't really even, I don't even have that. I think I just set it up one yeah. day without a photo, and I would probably yeah. want to bolster that a little bit, huh? Yeah, and, and during the install, I'll go through it with you, and I'm going to show you uh, what you can do to improve, okay? Now, if you don't have um, a lot of LinkedIn connections, don't stress about that. It, it, once you get over the 500 mark, uh, things start to accelerate. Okay, but it's a little slow coming out the gate if you're below 500, all right? And so, but it's not like, it's not a, it's just a little slower than, you're kind of like at a walking pace versus a jogging pace once you get over the 500 mark. Yeah, I have no idea if I've got any. But, mm. um, you know, there's another gentleman that works in the same uh, suite as I do, and he's, that works for me, Jason. This might be good for him too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Super. Yeah. Let's see how that would work. You know, kind of what my my schedule is is unfortunately I have an ailing father, and I'm going to go up and see him next Thursday through. The following Wednesday, mm. and I'll be back here. And what I'm thinking is, is I could, um, you know, between now and then, it's going to be kind of jammed with, you know, doing stuff I need to do mm -hmm. while I'm gone, stuff that I'm behind on, and whatever comes at me during the in the meanwhile. So I've got three days of that coming up. So I'm really not going to be able to concentrate on anything other than just kind of handling business, you know. Sure. But well, it's uh, gonna, I can. It, it's going to, uh, Mark. It's going to take us a couple of weeks uh, to, or it takes us a, a good solid week to get everything set up for you. So what we do is, one is we've got to get your accounts all built out. Okay. The second thing is when we get your your new inbox built for a week, we have some AI technology that goes in and it it warms up not just the inbox, but also your campaigns. And so the point of that is to get it where once we start messaging your people, um, that it uh, that it's that it's going to come out the gate with good results. Okay. And then the other thing that's going on uh, during that week is VJ and his team they're building connections. So so it, so I know you you're, you're trying to figure out, you know, what, what, where, where you are with things. So the point I'm just trying to let you know is whenever you decide or if you decide that this is right for you, um, then, uh, you know, it'll take us about a week uh, to 10 days to get it to the point where you're, you're actually launched. Right. And then what kind of involvement would you need from me during that time? Uh, the only thing we need is access to your LinkedIn, and then uh, that, that's the main thing. And then the next thing is I will have a call with you, about a 10-minute uh, a, a call where I'm walking you through those campaigns that I just described to you, and that's it. Okay, so not that involved. No, no, no. It's not, not on your part. Okay. And I think all I really need to do is think a little bit more about what I want to attack, mm -hmm. what would be the best target. And as far as um, what's kind of a, well, what is a, a like a decent number? Because, you know, sometimes I try to narrow it down to, like, for instance, let's talk about these uh, mortgage uh, real estate agents. Mm -hmm. So the real estate agent, mm -hmm. um, if I narrowed it down to, I think we had 6,000. I can't remember what our count was on that one. Yeah. Um, is that like still a sufficient amount to market towards? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, 6,000? 
that would last us six months. Okay. Uh, remember, I'm I'm going through about a thousand a month is what I'm going through. Okay. So, like, we could even pick harder ones and go after them that are smaller. And so, let's say you peel off and you say, "Well, uh, go do attorneys for me, right?" Uh, I'll come back with attorneys. I'm going to come out probably with a few hundred, but we could still do them, and then go back to agents or you know, we could say, all right, let's do, let's throw in financial advisors for a week or two, right? And put them into the mix and then go back to agents uh, or wh whatever we want to do. We can kind of rotate through it. Uh, you know, once you start having conversations, um, you, you're going to quickly go, you know, this is the guy you need to focus on. Well, this is the guy. And, um, Yeah, it gets more. It gets better. Mm, yeah, yeah. Okay, and then as far as looking up more information about your company that would be paying, mm -hmm. how would I get reviews on you? Uh, you can go to uh, look at the VFY Lead Factory. You can click it. Look on reviews right there. Okay, and then. The other, I'll send you, I already sent you a couple of links, okay? So if you go to DFI Lead Factory and you go to leadoutcome.com, on both of those, you'll see testimonials from people. You'll see reviews from people. You know that we've been around for over, uh, you know, since 2012. Uh, you know, we, we, we're not some fly-by-night organization is my point, okay? Uh, we've got right. over Yeah, and that's, that's all I really want to, that's all I really want to. Check out. Yeah, sure, sure. Go go look at Lead Outcome Inc. and I'll send you another. I'll send you a couple of emails with those links, and then you can uh, you can check us out. Where, where are you guys based out of? Atlanta. Okay. Yeah, I think um, I've got pretty much two and a half days, maybe even three full days to. To do this, so kind of see what well, the way I see it going is me doing taking time to kind of research your company number one, and then okay. uh, thinking about you know who to work, who to target, <clears throat> and then I'll probably I'll once once I decide that yeah we're going to do it, then I'll mm -hmm. probably ask probably have a small a short conversation with you about you know this this is what I'm thinking about you know who we should target what do you think you'll probably say yeah that's a good idea and then uh, let's do it type of thing and then mm -hmm. I take off kind of do my thing up in Oregon for a week mm -hmm. and then come back and um, be ready to go by at least by the beginning of this next month yeah yeah uh, because you want like to the background, yeah. and you can call me on my cell phone if you need a ten-minute call for me. I'm going to have my laptop with me. So. Yeah, yeah, that that sounds good. And I know you've got your 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 family, your father uh, that you're 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 working with, and and so you know maybe it makes sense to to do it after that. Um, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I hope everything's going good with your dad. I, uh, <laughs> I went through something yeah. like that not too long ago. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah. Mm, yeah, I hear you. Unfortunate okay. thing. Well, yeah. Yeah. So let's let's do that. Okay. Uh, so we'll, we'll we'll definitely today's already today's Friday. Huh? Wow, and the week went by fast. So yeah. So let's. I guess we'll we'll connect connect on uh, Monday. I'm sure. So I'll probably be talking to you. You know, at some point uh, Monday, you're three hours ahead of me. So I'll try to get get the call in before two my time, and okay. we'll go from there. Sounds like a plan. But uh, definitely sounds like something that I should attempt. Um, just kind of a little bit of background about me. I'm a I'm a good target for you because okay. everything that I've done for my whole career, which is since 1986 or 80, mm -hmm. yeah, about 86. Um, has always been word of mouth. 
um, I mean, as far as, you know, re- repeat customers and all that, I did yeah. a lot of direct mail marketing for about seven years. Yeah. And that worked, that worked great, you know, but, um, you know, the returns on that are just so minor now. Yeah. That it just, that just doesn't work. And, uh, then yeah. we, we did switch over to internet based lead providers and then that even got, uh, cost per funded loan went down. Mm-hmm. And then um, we went to a call transfers, which mm-hmm. those worked for a while. Um, then that percentage went down. So I am, am you know, I'm always open to different ideas. Uh, yeah. This is an idea that I haven't tried, so it's kind of one of those things that it, it makes sense. At least just getting your name out in front of people that. Maybe they're in in your community even. Mm. Yeah, and uh, they may they may be some recognition. Yeah. Jason, you taking off to San Diego? Yeah, yeah. All right. All right. All right. Have a good meeting. All right, buddy. I'll see you, man. Knock them out. All right, sounds good. All right, does it sound good, Will? Yeah, sounds good, Mark. Uh, I'll send you some emails so you can check us out. Uh, you know, on Monday, you know, we'll circle up, you know, you figure out, I know you got a lot to digest here. Um, but I, I agree with you. This is, there's a lot more, Mark, that I can show you. Okay. That goes beyond what we're doing here. This is the base system. Uh, but let's, let's, I've got to prove myself to you first. Okay. So we'll, we'll do that first. And, um, but uh, I, I think your logic that you just said, uh, you're spot on with that. I, I think you're going to see good results. Hey, well, what's your background? Um, you, you can look at my background. Like if you'll see at the bottom of my link, willberger.org. Um, but uh, I, I'm an engineer by trade, I, uh, and I'm very technology savvy. Uh, I've built quite a few companies. Uh, in my life, and when I say that, I, I'm three. <laughs> According yeah, to three. Yeah, that, that, that'll take three lives out of you. It, it, that, that's 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 very true. Okay, that, that's spot on. But I, I'm a technology guy. I like building process, repeatable processes. I got into marketing automation in 2008 with uh, one of one of the earlier companies that actually is where Lead Outcome comes from. Lead outcome that we formed in 2012. Um, you know, uh, we, what we did is with the previous company, uh, we really killed it with one of our, our, our systems where we were helping small business owners um, uh, help them sell products on the internet. Uh, we did about five million in just a few years. We took that and put that all into this platform. I mean, two and a half million of it. Uh, since then, we've been investing in it, investing in it, and uh, and it's just this really great nucleus of technology that we've got. And uh, and you know, I, I know you, you you see me and you see the inbox and the, the leads coming in, right? Uh, but for me, the the I, I really enjoy building that back end and and getting things where they're repeatable, and especially internet marketing, which is just it's it's a very difficult thing to do right and be able to repeat it and and um and so um so anyways there's there's a lot of interesting proprietary technology that's going on in the back end for us to get the kind of results that you're seeing with Denise, right? And um and so but that's that's my background. So. Oh good. That's a <laughs> perfect background to have for somebody that's delivering what you want to deliver to me. Yeah, yeah, it's it's pretty neat, and and with uh, you know, we really we we Mark, we we really specialize in your space, and you, you might be able to see, you know, like I I know a little bit about you know uh, uh, lending and things like that, and it's 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 really neat where you know we can do things like know how to strip out the uh, 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 you know the big boys with the you know the funding to really get you better results to really get that targeted list and and so it, it's kind of fun yeah i'm looking forward to it it'll be like you said it might be just that thing that uh is needed at this point for us yeah yeah 
And it's, uh, it is something that I've been thinking about, you know, growing again. Mm-hmm. Uh, it might be interesting to build on this. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. All right. Excellent. Thanks, Will. I really appreciate all your time. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you too for, for listening, Mark. And, you know, uh, really hope to, uh, to earn your business and, and, you know, hopefully have a, 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 a good relationship and, and, and get to know you a little bit better in your, in your company and, and, and see we can, how we can help you grow. I'd like that. Super, sir. Right, well, have, have, have a, a great weekend. weekend. Yeah, you too. See you. Bye. Bye-bye.